Yo, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Retax by Jiro, but hopefully, take a brand new video for you guys. Today, we are going to be playing Murderous Pursuit. Now, as you can see on my tablet right now, I have 3, 6, 9, 12 different games here. I was thinking about doing three games of video, but I didn't want to do like one long gameplay of each game, obviously, depending on how long I can go for and whatnot. So, let's jump into the first one here Murderous Pursuit. I don't know if I need to resize my camera or anything like that, so if I do, I will. And let's get right into it. Let's take a listen. I hope so. To determine your fate, I have arranged a little game. You and your fellow Nerdy Wells must engage in a deadly game of cat and mouse. A game where you must hunt and kill them before they can hunt and kill you. If oh. you perform these murders in a way that maximizes my favor and avoids drawing attention to yourself, then I will choose you. As my most trusted assistant. That's us. The losers will be Tevadaki. Alright, guys. I apologize, but alas, the name of Mr. X is hardly associated with mercy. Good luck, my friend. Let us hope time isn't against you, because everyone else is. That's actually a pretty good intro. So basically, we gotta try to kill off these people and blend in so we're not found. We don't want to be found. If we're found, I'm gonna say game is over. So this is gonna be very tricky, alright? This may take me a couple tries. I'm not gonna cut anything out. This is gonna be strict, wrong gameplay. So if this is something you guys wanna see me continue on, you know, if I go for like 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes, and you guys wanna see this series continue, let me know in the comments below, and maybe drop a like on the video. Alright, so we do have to load this up here, 95 megabytes. So I'm going to actually skip this part here. This part I will cut out until it's done, and I'll see you guys after. Alright, guys, we are in. So let's get right into it. So choose a letter to read. Uh, doesn't I, I don't know if it matters, but I'm going to go with the fella here. Please forgive my rudeness, but I am on a bit of a sticky wicket, and there is no one else to turn to. I'm reading off my monitor here instead of my tablet, because it's just easier. About two weeks ago, I took part in a game of cat and mouse here on the HMS Britannic. I thought things would go smoothly, and that I could easily walk away with the prize money. But then I got into an accident and lost part of my memory. What's even more worrying is that someone on the ship is actually trying to murder me. So, we can actually go back to the left above my head right there. And we can read the other one. So let's go ahead and read the other one. Dear Mr. and Mrs. whatever her name is. Well, hello there, cutie. Looks like I've got myself into some trouble. Huh, kitty? Would you care to hear my story? About two weeks ago, I took part in a game of cat and mouse upon the HMS Britannic. I thought it was going to be a piece of cake, but I was backstabbed and lost part of my memory. What's even worse is that someone on this ship really wants to kill me for real. I prepared a HMS C Britannic ticket for you. Come and help me. So... They basically the same story. Uh, both lost their memory for whatever reason. I'm gonna go with the fella here, just because. Why not? Uh, it doesn't really matter. So let's sign. So let's just do RTM. Confirm. RTMSG. Pink. All right. So let's get right into it. Attack carefully, otherwise you will suffer. So yeah, literally, we have to blend in with everybody. And we don't want to seem suspicious at all. I was reading some of the description of it. And they were talking about how if you walk too fast past people or other stuff like that, anything that might make you look out of place, you're done. So like I guess joining in conversations is normal type of thing. If you're not speaking to people, I honestly don't know what's going to happen with this game all right hi my dear friend welcome to h m i didn't get to read it 
an organizer to scheme X in a game earn to earn higher score you need to be 100 to kill your quarry while fleeing as a quarry high score becomes ultimate winner I'll fill your wish many cont contestants on board they're also figuring out how to kill you oh okay so everybody's trying to kill each other that's the whole point of this okay okay so left is to move right is to turn suppose rally again occurred right if you're exposed when exposed rally turns red and get your exposed state corresponding icon a hunter is near and your hunter will find you through the green mark above your head Use the sky skills. The area is enclosed by vignette. You can stand on the ground and vignette to reduce exposure. Click image to close. You can also use the sky skills. Oh. That was awkward. You have a green mark on top of the moon can cause exposure light. You can attack your hunter or quarry by taking the attack button. Click image to close. Wait. Quarry on the top when exposed. So, is he not exposed? Oh! Follow the midpoint of the green line to follow the quarry. So. If we look in, green lines fill and the hunters are very close. Find hidden quarry and kill nearby. Forward looking. Green lines are f full and hunters are very close. Alright. Follow midpoint. Quarry nearby. I like this. The longer the line, the closer the distance. I like this. I actually like this. This is pretty cool. Quarry's near. See the quarry is hidden here, but we can't determine who your quarry is in this group. We can use the reveal skill type. To get the identity. So nobody may also stun you when approaching. So it turns out that like nobody else cares. So like you can literally just kill the people and just keep going on with your day. Let me see. Let's do Let's just change some things here. Oh, we could do the layout and everything. Okay. Floor below, so we're going down here. There's our boy. Yo. Quarry kills stun hunters. When a quarry attacks you first, you will be stunned by a quarry. After being stunned, he is no longer the quarry. Oh. I hope that's him. There we go. Okay, this is pretty cool. It's simple, but this is cool. I like this. Alright guys, so we're actually 14 minutes in. I am definitely considering continuing the series, whether uh, you know I get zero likes or comments or anything like that. I definitely want to continue this. So basically we just learned the basics and everything. If you did enjoy, drop a like on this guys. 
we are going to end this here. And yeah, I'm out, guys. Have a wonderful day. Peace.